What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Looks like a beautiful day to go mountain biking, huh? Well, today we're gonna do something fun. It is Monday. On Wednesday, we're supposed to get even a bigger snowstorm. So I'm gonna go and spruce up one of the jumps that you saw in one of my videos from earlier this summer where we did our jump series. And we're gonna get it ready today so that we can session it on Wednesday. So first we gotta go to the hardware store, grab a few supplies, head over to the jumps. Let's see what kind of shape it's in and we'll get it ready for Wednesday's session. All right, so here's the game plan. As you can see, this is some pretty wet snow coming down, but all this snow is gonna melt and make it a sloppy mess. So we need to tarp it today so that on Wednesday, we can pull the tarp off. Things underneath will be a little bit drier and then we can have a sick snow session. Three feet by 50 feet, perfect lift for the running. Not looking too bad. There's a jump and a run under that snow, but gotta get the snow off. Tarp it, come back, it's gonna be dope. Jump tarped. 50, no, 100 feet of clear plastic. And uh, it's really slippery now, but this snow is gonna keep falling. And it's supposed to be wet tomorrow and warm. So I don't want this to get too saturated. And then on Wednesday, it'll snow again. Stoked, now it's just time for mother nature to do her job and make this setting look super sweet. All right, it's snow day, but as you can see, there's no snow outside. We even have a photographer today, so hopefully we're gonna get a sick photo. But it's about 3.30 and it gets dark at about 4.30, so it needs to start snowing fast. All right, I look like Cornhole from Beavis and Butthead. All right, the snow's coming down, this is pretty sweet. I untarped everything that I tarped the other day, and in hindsight, that probably wasn't a good idea because it ended up keeping everything warm and then the ground ended up being a little wet. So the run-in actually is wet and this riding surface here is all frozen. So might've been a better idea to not tarp it. It ended up like literally the second I finished tarping it, it stopped snowing. So I don't think it really did anything other than keep the run-in a little wet. But for the most part, it's all in pretty good shape. So I think it's gonna be fun and hopefully we get a couple cool photographs out of it. It's pretty cold though, it's only 25 degrees. <laughs> All right, let's see how this goes. You wanna do rock, paper, scissors and see who goes first? Why would I wanna go first? I don't know, just to go first. All right, here it goes. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Brakes sound good. I just washed my bike for the big shoot and it sounds disgusting. This is going to be like Inception, a video of a video. Nice. All right, it took me about one second to realize why when you go skiing and you go snowboarding, you wear goggles. Because even with only a tiny bit of snow falling, it totally goes right in your eyes and you can't see. So we're going to get some goggles. All right, that one was a tiny slow, so go a little bit faster. It's hard to tell. The ground is so soft. Let's give it another shot. What's the strategy with the flashes and stuff? So this is what it looks like if it doesn't go off. I gotta work on the timing a little. Okay. But there's like with the light. So oh, I'm really gonna like silhouette you. And honestly like as the sky gets a little darker by like every minute the, the snow is going to start to light up too. Sick. Yeah. It's so scary when your soles are rock hard and your shoes, your pedals are wet. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, sick. That is pretty freaking cool. That's super sick. Thank you. <laughs> Yeah, it's it's sketchy though because the pedals are like slippery and the shoes are rock hard and I don't know if I have them. If I did, I'd be like the cheat code. Yeah. 
Let's see. Bum, ba -dum, bum, bum. Look at that. Sick. Game on. So we're gonna put on some Shimano SPD pedals and hopefully this is a cheat code. It's one of those things that I like from the get-go I always kind of focused on lighting because I was like it gets like very technical sometimes so I'm like that's my leg up because I don't feel like I'm super naturally talented at it but if I like I can study harder than everybody else essentially. Nice. Yesterday you could see the snow the snowflakes. Falling down? Yeah. What's that? Are you I'm recording me? you. Nah. I'm gonna get a shot of getting a shot. Dude, that looks sick. Nice. Yeah, Snow? I'm afraid it's like slippery and if I like carve off of it, I'm gonna like Yeah, slide die. out. <laughs> How'd that come out? Oh, sick. Yeah, snow's really starting to show up too. Oh my God, yay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's getting dark. But this is when it's starting to look so sick. All right, you ready? All right, dropping. Uh, that sucked. In like, it's like Star Wars. I did like Star Wars. That's it. Come on. Okay, go that was good. Again, do it again, but just do it better. Same, but different. Same, but better. Any better? I'm getting it. Oh, sick. And then that's where the snow is really showing up now. Oh, dang. That looks sick. so good. Oh, yeah. Perfect weather for hidden jumps. What could possibly go wrong? All right. It's snowing now. That's Fike Photography, also a mountain biker. You did the Trail Boss Challenge, which was sick. Yes, I did. All right, so we're hitting this jump in the snow. What's your strategy for lighting this thing up? Uh, so I wanted to do it when it was a little darker out um, so I could light everything up and have like control over what the light's doing. Uh, most of the time I set my flashes up behind them so it would backlight all the snow. That was and weird. I'm usually used to the flashes hitting, hitting you in the face. face. Yeah. yeah. Like if you're ever like, I mean, even in the snow or the rain, like if you see like somebody's headlights, the rain really like pops when it's yep. backlit. So, so you're doing that to accentuate the snow as much yeah, as Yeah, exactly. Possible. It was really to like light up the snow and really just give some like really cool dramatic light for the environment. Sick. Probably is a good idea that you shut us down right now too, because it is getting a little slick. Yeah. That's the thing, it's yeah. I noticed it coming over that turn over there. I was starting to peel out a little bit, like on the turn and then this hump, this carpet is ice. So I'm gonna quit while we're ahead. All right, dude, I'm stoked. Right on, man. That was awesome. I'd like to say that was my idea, but it wasn't my idea. It was all hers. It was my idea. Thanks for the awesome idea. Thanks for checking out the video. Until next time, you know what it is? Get out there and be a boss.